Hi everyone, this is Jungli family and welcome back to our channel. Today we will take you on a virtual tour of the sightings we had during our visit to the other two zones of Kanha, Kanha and the Kisli zone. In case you are looking for details about Mukhi zone of Kanha, please do not forget to visit our previous video. We will be leaving a link to the previous video in the description below. Currently there are three entrances to the national park. Khatia Gate, Mukhi Gate and the Sarahi Gate. The core zones of Kanha are Kanha, Sarahi, Mukhi and Kisli. Jabal is the nearest airport which is at a distance of 140 kilometers approximately around 3 hours free. You can also land at the Nagpur airport which is at a distance of 260 km and it takes approximately around 5 hours from there. In case you are planning to visit either Kanha, Kesli or Mukhi zone, you can book a gypsy to enter from the Khatia gate. Morning safari timings are 5.45 in the morning, last stay. 11.30. Evening safari timings are between 4 in the evening till 6. The safari timings may vary depending on the season that you visit this park in. In case you are new to our channel, do not forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to miss the notification of our videos. Booked a full gypsy and it had costed us 7500, which included permit charges per driver and also guide charges. You can also book a single seat instead of book a gypsy. Weekend and weekday safari permit charges are different. Weekend charges are a bit higher than the weekday charges. You can book your safaris directly from the MM site. We will be providing the site in the description below. Among the many first Kana Singha's attention, successfully rewilded or tiger cubs and also encouraged inclusiveness by training capable women guide and drivers. Kanha zone has open meadows with grassland and vegetation that offer some unique sightings. While the Kisli zone also has elegant sal forests and scenic grasslands with bamboo vegetations. Kana has a wide variety of accommodation. The Khatia Gate site has now become almost overcrowded with resorts while the Mukhi still remains a more peaceful experience. If you are interested to know more about where we are staying, please visit our previous video. The link to the video is provided in the description below. Do not forget to carry your binoculars and cameras to make the most out of your safari.
Kanha is a photographer's paradise to capture amazing wildlife in their natural habitat, especially the Kanha meadows. Finally, some movement in the grasslands caught our attention and out came this majestic beast. We are the center point. Most resorts provide a packed breakfast so that you can have your breakfast at the center point. This is the famous arc that was built in 2015 using antlers from male deers. These antlers are grown on male deers every year before the breeding season and are shed off after the breeding is over. वही पहुंचाने का है अभी पहुंचाने वाला है ना वो इसलिए बना है
बांधवगढ़ के लिए बांधवगढ़ के लिए सिर्फ बारह सिंगा भेजेंगे कि ये नॉर्मल डियर की बारह सिंगा बारह सिंगा सब जगह पहला देंगे तो एक बच्चे जाएगा ना ये अगर एक जगह रहेंगे अगर दो कैसे एक्सीडेंट हुए कुछ तो पूरे खत्म हो सकते हैं इसलिए इनको ट्रांसफर कर रहे हैं एक दो नहीं तीस पैंतीस पचास यहाँ हो गए ना पर यहाँ छोड़ने लगे हैं धीरे धीरे हजार के करीब पहुँचने लगा संख्या यहाँ सिक्सटी सिक्स थे पहले यहाँ पे और कितना सिक्सटी सिक्स सिक्सटी सिक्स ओनली उधर से हजार के आसपास हो गया हाँ अभी हजार उन्नीस सौ तिहत्तर से काउंटिंग चालू रोज काउंटिंग रोज काउंटिंग मतलब काउंटिंग होती है सुबह भी होता है और शाम को भी होता है ये बारह सिंगा को भी टाइगर खाते हैं हम्म खाते हैं जो पकड़ना है जाए और इसका काउंटिंग इसमें आसानी रहता है क्योंकि ये मैदान इलाके में रहने वाला जानवर डाल दिए तो उनको लगना नहीं चाहिए कि यहाँ पे वो है। The National Park opens between 1st of October and remains open till 30th of June every year. It remains shut during the monsoon season. However, the buffer zones are open during this time. Naturally, the peak tourist times is during the holiday and long weekends. So, if you want to avoid crowds, don't plan your trips during these days. December to March is considered to be the best time to visit Kanha as the winter weather slowly gives way to early spring. Sightings are good, and you get to see a wide variety of mammals and birds. Tigers also settle into their routes and territories, making tracking easier. Due to the dense forests, elephants are used for patrolling the forest. This does not only help in making the task of keeping an eye on poachers easy, but also helps in keeping an eye on tree fellers.
As our journey comes to an end in Kanha, we look forward towards our next safari destination. Let us know if you enjoyed our content and also consider subscribing to our channel and hit the bell icon for further notifications. We hope you enjoyed the biodiversity we've managed to bring to you. There's a lot of animal behavior that we have focused on because we want this channel to be more than just about tigers.